Breaking news, my wonderful people. PDP members, okay, the faction that are planning to leave, are meeting up with Peter Obi to, you know, look at 2023 because they can see that the boat or the ship called PDP may not be ready to sail in terms of, you know, Atiku not able to put the people together and he wants to make a win. So PDP members in Port Harcourt are meeting with the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, looking at possibility of them, you know, uh, joining the Labour Party. This is becoming a real serious issue. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. 2023, Peter Obi meets Wiki faction of PDP in Port Harcourt. Can you imagine? This is the people that belongs to Wiki and PDP who are not happy with the current disposition. Let's get all the details. Peter Obi has again met with the aggrieved faction of the People Democratic Party, led by Newsom Wiki of River State. The Labour Party presidential candidate has initially met with some members of the People Democratic Party caucus separately. The, the frequent meeting between Peter Obi and the People Democratic Party chieftains has sparked rumors of a political alliance ahead of 2023 polls. Peter Obi has stated, Wiki has stated it loud and clear that he will not work with Tinubu because he is not confident in the Muslim Muslim ticket. Peter Obi, the Labour Party presidential candidate on Monday, August the 15th, met with Newsom Wiki, the faction of the People Democratic Party in Port Harcourt. Wiki, River State Governor, has been having a running battle with the People Democratic Party presidential candidate and former Vice President Halaji Atiku Abubakar. Photograph of which has, was taken during the last hours of the day was shared by Dr. Olusek Obimiko, a former governor of Ondo State, who was also at the meeting with Peter Obi and others to deliberate. Wiki's men have been meeting with Peter Obi mm -hmm. recently, but no real statement has been said in that regard as to what their decision has finally come to be. But Peter Obi has looked is now looking like the new bride, which everyone is coming up with and working and strategizing to see how they can make a win and make a difference in terms of all that is currently on ground. Peter Obi is the presidential candidate of the Labour Party. And whether you like it or not, a lot of persons are coming on board to say, you know what, let's stick together because we're believing that you could be somewhere, someone, somewhere. So this is what is happening right now, my wonderful people. And as you and I can see, things are looking quite differently. And uh, Nigerians were not sure of what is going to be happening next. Politically speaking, a lot of those persons and people know exactly, you know, who could possibly make a lot of difference in Nigeria for now. But guess what? They have decided to be adamant and play a different, you know, take a different turn in terms of what is going on. They've decided to pretend that they are not aware of the things that are happening. Okay, you know very well, you know, as you and I know, that this person have no iota of good or, you know, something that could potentially make Nigeria better or change the course of what is on ground. Well, guess what? These people can't be bothered. They want Nigeria to remain just the way it is. They want, they want Nigeria to stay at the same position, not moving forward, nothing changing, nothing. I mean, things getting worse. Buhari came in. And if we, if we have taken a pause, okay, if we had been where we are in 2015, that would have been great. It would have been awesome, okay? If we have remained in that position, not going forward, not going behind, just being in one position like a pause situation, that would have been great. But guess what? All those has been eradicated, thrown away, and these persons can't be bothered with the current disposition of what is on ground. These very sad same people are the one doing whatever they're doing for their own personal, for their personal selves.
and these are issues truly sincerely going on and nigerians you cannot begin to imagine how devastation and you know all the things that have come to be with regards to this person's doing everything humanly speaking possible to see to it that they remain there peter will be you know the presidential candidate of the labor party all of a sudden have since gotten you know the 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 the, the, the wealth of support is beyond words a lot of persons have come on and say you know what peter will be we we believe in you and we can see i mean the other day the guy it's not because he flies economy it's not be, i mean he's a humble man genuinely speaking someone who is humble you know and um, he's, show, he's showing it he's not trying to you know he's not trying to be uh, anybody else and this is what is best you know really really annoying the other politicians they don't want someone who will come and bring it you know a change to the course of governance they want things to remain just the way it is because it gives them you know they make a lot of gain from it so they don't care what's happening to nigerians they don't want to know they really sincerely speaking don't want to know they just go ahead and just you know pretend and just carry on as if it's business as usual so these are some of the possibilities and uh, nigerians and we're just watching and seeing how things will change anyway my wonderful people uh bit uh, wiki and you know his group in in labor in uh in in port harcourt are meeting up with peter obi to see how they could possibly make a lot of difference we'll watch and see how some of these things will play out remember that every one of us have got a duty to ensure we speak out on what is right we cannot allow these people who to a large extent most of them are only doing things that brings them what you know what they what they what they think they deserve to become our leaders we can't afford such people you know being our leaders we can't okay so let's go ahead and make sure that we have our pvcs let's make sure that we are ready to vote come rain come shine we are ready to bring about you know the next line of action and ensure things you know things change drastically let's ensure that let's ensure that we do what is right okay let's ensure we do what is right so it is what it is my wonderful people and it's about time we all begin to rise up to the occasion and ensure that we do not allow certain individuals okay deter and you know truncate that which belongs to every one of us it's about time really sincerely speaking please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news remember you have a voice let us speak out against everything and anything that will not move this nation forward god bless have a fantastic day bye for now